Hi, I'm Mrs. Schaefer and welcome to my classroom. This is kind of hidden back away uh, down around the corner, but would like to welcome you to my room. And as you can see, that this is a computer lab. I am a CTE teacher, which stands for Career and Technical Education. And we focus on classes that help prepare us for the future in, in jobs and, and things like that. I teach three classes. Three different kinds, I teach the college and career awareness, and I teach two different sections of that. Those of you who will have me, will all seventh graders will have me for health occupations, for agriculture occupations, and for public safety corrections and security occupations, which seems to be very in the news and in the media and in our lives for the last few months, quite a lot. So. It kind of ties right into the pandemic things we've been experiencing. Also, part of you, well, some of you will have me for industrial arts and uh, technology and engineering, and that will happen in the spring. I also teach digital literacy, which will help you uh, get more familiar with the uh, computers. And so some, most, some seventh grade and some eighth grade will have me for that class. Ninth graders, you would have me for exploring computer science, which is a class that will give you the digital citizen, digital digital studies cre credit for high school graduation, and that will be an exciting thing to let you know a little bit more about computers and coding and and if you're interested in that kind of field. Um, we will also have all of my activities and lessons and things will be included on Canvas. So even though we'll be doing things here in the classroom, if for some reason you're not able to be able to be in class with us, then you'll be able to access things on Canvas. But because we are also working with different kinds of computer software, you'll use lots of different kinds of programs, but all of it should be available on the internet. Uh, so that you, if you have to do it at home, you should be able to do it easily with a Chromebook or some other kind of digital device to be able to access it. Just a little bit about myself. I have seven children and 27 grandchildren. And just like you've been experiencing good times and difficult times during the last few months, we've lost family members um, during the pandemic. We've added had new grandbabies during the pandemic, but we're excited to be able to move forward, to enjoy being together as a family. As you can see, I have a large family, but I consider Joel P. Jensen my family as well, and would like to welcome you to our Joel P. Jensen Middle School family.